Good evening. I'm going to be sharing daily meditations with the Holy Spirit for the 19th of April, 2021. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Holy Michael Archangel, defend us in this day of battle. We are safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and do thy prince of the heavenly host, by the power of God, thrust down to hell, Satan and all the wicked evil spirits who wander through the world for the ruin of souls. Amen. The reading today is from Isaiah, I love Isaiah, 11 verse 2. Spirit of knowledge and of fear of the Lord, and he shall delight in the fear of the Lord. The reflection, even if we were to study the wonders of the world until the day we died, we would never know them all. The Spirit reveals those things to us that help us grow in the spirit of awe and wonder. We generally think that the spirit reveals heavenly things, but through the spirit we also come to understand the mysteries of this created world. The prayer, may I know all that I can and be humble enough to admit what I don't know. I think that would take forever to say what I don't know. <laughs> I'm sure that might apply to some of you as well. The more you look at the wonders of the world, the more you know you don't know anything at all. You, you, you. If you're like me, I mean, I'm. 74 and I'm still learning about the wonders of the world. The great and amazing thing about YouTube and, and all these sort of internet um, platforms is you can see the world without going there and it's beautiful, it's wonderful, it's exciting, it's marvellous. You can see the good things as well as the bad things and the wonders of the world and God's creation and all the programs that you only need to search and you can find the most beautiful and if you didn't even know God because of your background and where you live you only need to look at creation in some parts of the world to know that a creator created this it's so marvellous, it's so exciting, it's so beautiful, it's so amazing all the creatures, the animals, everything that God has created is good and beautiful. It's only mankind who ruins it. So yes, it's very inspiring. But we can also learn from very holy priests and people like that, monks and others who've studied and are very learned. I learn a lot by listening to them. They're very wise and they recommend all kinds of books and they tell us exactly as it is. Whereas there's plenty of others telling you a whole lot of things you want to hear and for the major part some of it is lies and it's not the truth. And some of them are saying that everyone will go to heaven. When you get deeper into your faith you're aware that that is not the case. Me men and women and we put ourselves in a position of going to hell we're not sent to hell by God we're sent there by ourselves and what we do or don't do what we fail to do or what we actually do you can't tell me someone like Hitler will be in heaven no way even if he repented of his death because it would have to be a true repentance. Anyway, I've said enough about evil. I want to just keep happy and good. 
I might be re recording live later. I might do the Psalter of Jesus. It's very long. It took me all day to type it to half past four. Fifteen petitions, non-stop typing. <laughs> oh dear.